Hello there. there. Welcome to today's video. I'm going to be going through this sketchbook today. I want to do a little bit of a rambling first before anything. So if you're just here for the video, the sketchbook tour, go to whatever time there is on screen. I was gone for two months. Sorry about that. Uh, it was not on purpose. I just got busy like really fast for some reason. So sorry about that. But I'm back. For all the art that I have been doing, uh, I've just been posting it on TikTok and mostly Instagram. Uh, in the time I have been gone for two months, one of my videos blew up. My last sketchbook tour that I recorded just suddenly got like over 7,000 views. Hi, editor me here. Uh, the footage got corrupted, but I also hit over 300 subscribers now. Thank you very, very much. That's all I really have to say. Uh, on to the actual sketchbook tour. Alright, this is the cover again. It's, uh, it's peeling. I think I said in the intro, uh, how it was difficult to paint this. I actually had a different painting before and then I didn't like it so I painted over it and restarted and this is what I got. Uh, I did make a video on that so feel free to watch. Uh, we also have the back. I like I like that. And opening it here's the cover page. Uh, I don't like it. It's boring. So moving on. This was the original planning page for the original ideas that I had it was gonna be some of my characters having a snowball fight because it was snowing in February for some reason. This page is a little bit boring but yeah we got some characters, we got Spider-Man, some stickers. Here we got more pen doodles, pencil doodles, and uh, some doodles that were on some other paper and I just sort of stuck in here. More doodles. I think I was just trying to fill up the pages. Um, yeah, we even got a cool wrapper in here. Ah, this was a drawing I did to try and win some paint markers. Some paint pens, yes. From Artex. I, uh, I didn't win, but that's fine. Uh, the prompt was to draw their little Easter character uh, in a hiding place, so I put him in a little Easter basket. Here I was doing some reference art of Dana Terrace. She's the creator of uh, the Owl House, so I was sort of stud studying her style and the Owl House style, and then sort of applying it to my own. So like these I had with reference. Then this was my own that I did. This is a throwaway page. Here's like a little sketch of the cover page because I went back to that because I changed the whole thing. Then some doodles that I stuck in here. Oh, here are some doodles drawings that I did of My Little Pony characters as humans. That's all there really is to it. I like this one the best. Uh, I did Rarity, her hair, I like it. Oh, we got Rosa! If you've watched any of my other videos, mostly sketchbook tours, and you'd know that Rosa is like one of my favorite characters. I made her into a doll. Um, I draw her all the time. Uh, but here's some more pen sketches of her. Uh, yeah. Oh, another page like this. This was just some quick character design I was sketching out for this queen lady. more Rosa. Uh, this was like some outfit, like what outfit she has throughout her time as a character. Um, there are more than this. And then I think I was putting them into other drawings. Here I was practicing some like different body types and different faces. Uh, I didn't finish it so I just filled in with some random 
random doodles. Uh, this page was uh, when I went to the toy show in my city. Yeah, sure. Uh, the toy show is like an annual thing. They do it once or twice a year. Uh, and then I was just like listing like all the things I got, things that my friends got, and then I some other things that I saw that I'm like, I wish I got it, but I didn't have enough money. Or else I would have. And then this was actually from the actual show, one of the vendors. And it has some like cards in it and stuff. Like that. That was my wristband, I guess. More Rosa. Uh, uh, this was a little doodle for a bigger drawing. I haven't finished. I've worked on it. Not a lot, but I have. And then some other doodles for other things. Like Lily, Rosa's daughter. Another boring page I don't really like. Got Ida. And then random characters. More Rosa. Mostly from other places. And then the bunch of chocolate wrappers. Because I love chocolate. Uh, this was some of these. It's hard to see, but they're from like directly after a war she was in. Here are some sketches I did. I went and saw some movies and I stuck in the tickets. And then I drew around them the movie. So here is the Mario movie. And then the Titanic, because it was in theaters again. So I rewatched it. Here we got some anatomy. I think I drew this in media class it, rather than doing stuff that I was supposed to be doing. I'm happy with it though. Uh, here's more doodles. Uh, I think some Star Wars characters, random characters, and then me for my birthday. More Rosa. Rosa, Rosa. Uh, I think Jinx from... Arcane, a little couple doodles of myself, some of my friends, and more Rosa. I think that's my cat. <laughs> or my grandma's cat, I should say. Um, on this side, we have some black paper where I've taken a white pencil crayon, I drew a skull on it, and then you flip it up, and then it's a full skeleton. Uh, it's pretty cool. I like it. And then on this side, just some pen doodles of... Rosa, Rosalie, Rosalie, Haley, Anthony, and then some random characters. Oh, I drew uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi and Ahsoka Tano for May the 4th. Posted that on Instagram. Here's some... These are all the same characters. Uh, this is Ruby. I think that's her name. So, like, some different alternative outfits for her. Uh, I drew mermaids for Mermay. I didn't end up posting it because I didn't really like it. That's fine though. This is uh, Damien, I think. He's a demon and he's very fashionable, as you can tell by his really cool checkered pants. Um, now for the next few pages, you're going to wonder why there's like paper in between. That's because the pages stick together and rip, like right here where it wasn't covered. But they're painted with acrylic paints. Uh, this is a self, sort of self-portrait of myself. I actually did this the other day. As in like a couple days ago. Uh, we got some skull things. I don't know what animals they're from. But I did these super fast and I'm actually really happy with them. And then lastly, it's one of my original characters. Um, this one actually did rip quite a bit, um, which is unfortunate, but I, I fixed it. That's fine. Uh, we got some more pencil and pen sketches on post-its and then just on the paper itself. <laughs> this is one of my favorite spreads. Uh, this is one of my friends. This is the other one. <laughs> I don't know, I like this. It's funny. This I drew on a paper towel and then I pasted it in. That's fun. 
It's another one of my older friends. Um, then we got some of my characters in sort of a chibi form, and then myself as a goober. If anyone knows what a goober is, good for you. Ow! Oh, Rosa as a pirate! <laughs> I don't know, it's a funny idea I came up with with one of my friends. Uh, then this was a little sketch I did for a digital drawing of myself. Of course, we got Ikea Shark. Here I turned some fruits into people. My favorite is the blueberry hair girl. These aren't really very good. I was just messing around. This page I just covered in paint. And then I had stuck stickers and other doodles on top of it. Not very really interesting, but I, I kind of like it. Uh, lots of Rosa, and then some random characters as well. None of this is very good. Uh, this was a doodle, uh, like planning for a painting that I have been working on for a while now. Um, don't know when that video is going to come out. It will eventually. And then there's me playing the piano. Uh, more anatomy. I don't like this page at all. <laughs> this is another one of my favorite spreads. This is Will Wood. Uh, I got bored one night, and I this is like right when I was starting to listen to his music. I'm pretty new to it all, but... Uh, I just found a whole bunch of references on Pinterest, and I just started drawing them. This, this, this is what I want my sketchbook spreads to look like. The texture, all the different uh, materials I used. I don't know. I like it. It's fun. Uh, this is more self-portraits of myself in pen, a uh, pencil crayon, and then this one I painted. I don't know. This... Th these two pages are like how I want my sketchbook spreads to always look. This page is random doodle of some guy. I don't know. Uh, and then on this side is just a bunch of stuff I randomly stuck in. I, I don't really know. Uh, here we have a character, a witch character I'm working on with one of my friends. Making witch characters based on ourselves. And of course mine's a moth <laughs> and green. I love green. Uh, so I was designing their sort of cape thing. And then I designed some other outfits for them. This one's like going to be their main outfit probably. Um, yeah. I like, I like this one the best. <laughs> we got more Rosa. I actually finished this the other day. It's a bunch of expressions. Uh, I just, I got bored one day and started drawing different expressions. And, uh, some some of these ones are some of the best ones. Uh, they're not meant to be very good. They're just sort of be like five minute sketches. Like you can see from the start, like I started off like trying really hard, and then quickly it just it becomes that. <laughs> I like it though. Uh, some Star Trek Next Gen characters. Uh, they look nothing like the reference. Um, don't really like this page. Um. Random characters I doodled in the middle of the night. They... I don't know. This was kind of cool. I don't know. Another throwaway page. Uh, I was testing out some pens. That's about it. This one's sort of throwaway page. I was testing out those pens again. And then this side is some of my newer characters. Damien and Vivian. And their siblings. That's also Vivian right there. And, uh, th this is probably my favorite drawing in this entire book. Uh, I'm very proud of it. Uh, uh it's them. They, their whole story goes into why they are covered in blood. Uh, I'm not gonna go into it now. It's too much to explain. But I really like this drawing, and I want to draw them more. Uh, it's hard to see, but on the side there's more Vivian drawings and more here. This is when she's older. Uh, she has like a cool wolf cut thing going on. And there's some more of Damien and Vivian here. Uh, they have a weird dynamic of like a black hat and golden retriever. 
I don't know. I love them. They're so goofy. Uh, more of the uh, movie theater tickets. Here on this side is Spider-Man. And then on this side is uh, Puss in Boots. Uh, this, uh, I used uh, like wax crayons on this side and it's rubbed off on the painted side. Which is too bad. I don't really like this spread anyway. Uh, I wish I would more. I wish I was more motivated to to work on it. Uh, here we got some planning for some. These are actually some older characters, um, so I was just like redesigning them a little bit for a bigger drawing. Uh, more redesigning and posing. Can't really see it, but on the next page, this this I've this was the last thing I finished in this book. Uh, this is like I'm super proud of this. Um. Uh, yeah, this is like it. The main focus is the the characters, specifically these two, uh, Madeline and Heather. Uh, so don't really worry about the background. I know it kind of looks not great, but I'm still super proud of it. There's more planning because uh, once I started sketching this, I realized that I hadn't figured out some of the other characters. Uh, I didn't really know it to. Put on this page, so I sort of just left it blank. That's fine. Uh, this is some random workout girl that I drew. Uh, nothing to say about that. This is me, a bunch of me, and uh, some of my new friends uh, on a movie set because I do that now, apparently. Some just like background stuff. Uh, but here I just walked into a bunch of mosquitoes and got a bunch of bites, and I was not very happy about that. Uh, this page, I do not like at all. It's boring. There's nothing going on very good. Same with this page, it's just a bunch of random character faces. Uh, don't like it either. Uh, this page is super boring also. Just trying some gestures for a specific, for a future video sort of thing. Uh, I don't really have much to say on that. And finally, I ended it with um, another movie ticket and Indiana Jones. Or Harrison Ford or whatever. Um, I actually do like this. This is kind of fun. And that that's, that's the sketchbook. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know how it went. I haven't recorded the actual tour yet. I hope you like this sketchbook. Uh, hopefully I'll start posting regularly again. If not, I'm sorry. It's gonna be a lot of sketchbook content because I need to start a new one. Hopefully I'll do that next week. Yeah, thank you for watching. Um, again, thank you for all the new subscribers and welcome. I hope, I hope you like my content. Um, yeah, bye-bye.